Right, hey guys, how are we doing? Back another video from Giggle, off the second channel. Gawk. We're going to check out, I watched every anime spring 2024. So this is where he goes through all the, the trailers and stuff for all the anime that is upcoming. Um, I am excited for Mishoku Tensei's return. I actually watched the first episode of it yesterday. Good comeback. That time I was reincarnated as a slime. Seen three episode one, was great. And My Hero Academia is just recapping all the old seasons, apparently. I was very disappointed with that. <laughs> I did not know that was a that was a thing. Uh, and I'm really looking forward to Kaiju number 8 as well, which I will be reacting to on the Patreon page when it starts coming out. Let's see what else is happening. What we are going to be doing today is we are going to be going through the Spring 2024 anime chart and seeing what anime is going to be worth watching. Either I'm going to be putting a show as a must watch, a three episode, a one episode, or, skip. or a skip. Okay. And we are going to be going through in alphabetical order just in case there are some hype shows that are not some of the most popular shows of the season all right let's start off Astro with astronaut from telecom animation films not heard anything about this one takami a gifted chef was just let go from his job he lands a gig at an old boarding house called astrosaur but hesitates to accept after learning he must also live there full time that is until he meets the beautiful and charming caretaker mira and he's sold of course <laughs> He meets a girl. <laughs> the two begins to work together and the connection deepens, but Mira oh. has a secret. She isn't from this world. We are, <laughs> no. we are starting off with it's a reverse isekai. A reverse isekai, <laughs> baby, of course. Is it an isekai or she is she an alien? <laughs> ah, she's an alien. <laughs> That's funny. What? I swear to God, I've used that exact sound effect before. <laughs> no. Anime YouTubers, we, we aren't so different after all. <laughs> okay, okay, what? Okay, okay. okay, wait, wait, wait. The synopsis did not tell me anything about a talking dog. What, what the f? This Wait, seems so ridiculous. I didn't know we were bird watching in America. <laughs> um, what else has Telecom Animation done? <laughs> oh, the Griffin Boy anime. I've got watched that myself, but that's interesting. Well, guys, no, oh, it's a it's a wrap. That's why they put the gun in it, man. America is taking over anime and we can't stop it, all right? Oh, God. I have a feeling that I'm going to give this one one episode, Ooh, that's the maybe more, one. because I, I want to check that out. like the fact that it's an... Because I used to be a bartender and I was really sexy. I'm still sexy now, just not a bartender. Original anime. It has not got any source material in it. Next up, we have Bartender Kamino oh, Grasu. That's a good if you shake, didn't that know. Oh, but he's using one of those tacky ones with the lid that you pour out. No, you should use the double and then like, nah. Bartender was an anime where different people that had different problems in their lives and the whole concept of it was they would go to this bartender and the bartender would basically make them a cocktail that would be like the perfect cocktail for whatever they're going oh. through it was a very very comfy anime and i enjoyed the original All a lot right. free therapy yeah it's a uh, therapy through cocktails also known as alcoholism <laughs> i was about to make that joke <laughs> oh. i made some amazing french martinis the other day that sorted me out Fwah. pineapple juice vanilla vodka chambord a little bit of sugar syrup boom you're looking at 50 ml pineapple juice 40 ml uh, vanilla vodka, 20 ml shambord, and just 10 ml of that sugar syrup. And then if you've got some like, kind of like strawberry sprinkles to put on top for decoration, magnifique. Oh, and you know that shot probably burns like shit, but holy crap, I wanna wanna drink that so bad. Bro. She's using the tacky cocktail shaker. Oh, how clean does That's he very clean bar. keep his table, man? Yo, this is Weatherspoons, that shit would be- <laughs> He's sticky as hell, He's man. <laughs> no. oh. Should double strain. Should double strain. Make sure there's absolutely no ice poured into the drum. I should react to this. <laughs> uh, for sure. I'm, I'm... <laughs> yes. <laughs> that, it just looked too refreshing, cheers, right? It just cheers. looked too refreshing. 
the way that it portrays the vibe of going to an independently owned bar like this and you just see that one bartender who owns the entire bar it's a single room there's no menu so all cool. you do is you go in and you oh, just got the order cool. whatever you feel like and he'll make it for you that is just such a good fucking vibe i'm gonna give this one three episodes is it bad I might check it out. That's, that I'm like, yeah, this is my vibe. This is my vibe. What's my vibe? Drinking, drinking Oof. alcohol. <laughs> All right. Next, we have Blue Archive, Blue Archive, the animation. Oh, so is it like a game or something or a graphic novel or something? Yo, Star is back. We're going to go hashtag ad here. Frothing immediately. <laughs> what, is, what is going on with chat? Right yeah, now? I was gonna say it's like going crazy. <laughs> I don't know why there's so many crying emojis in chat right now. I don't, I don't get it. What the fuck have I missed? That's crazy. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's the FBI calling. I did not get. The anime will adapt. This... All right, so, so it must be from a game or something else, or, or like a much you know, those... from that trailer and i'm not familiar with the game itself so, so i probably am going to skip this one all right moving on to my hero academia so confused man i was watching it and i was like why is it got this the, i think it's the second season maybe the first season's like opening then it was just recapping season one and a bit of season two and then it's like ah is all it doing for the next first like few episodes recapping the past seasons because that annoys me every time my academia comes back or has a break or anything it always has like a recapping stuff we're the seven seasons in why do you have to recap every single season beforehand <laughs> yo america enters the fray let's go, let's go. america's coming to save my year academia <laughs> Yeah. America is like, I've heard too many people calling the show Mitt. I think at this point, I've watched six seasons of My Hero Academia. I'm kind of just committed. It kind of reminds exactly me. That's exactly me as well. That's, that's a lot, isn't it? Like, I, I, I made, the t made the time to catch you up and then watch that last one. And now I'm like, right, okay, yeah, six seasons in. Let's check it out. And I'm just watching recap episodes. Oh, back in the day when I finished, yeah. like, Bleach. I finished the Bleach manga, even though I had fallen out of love with it for, like, a long time. Moving on to Byokyaku Battery. Iron Armed right. Pitcher, Hiraku Kiyomine, uh, and the shrewd catcher, Kei Kaname, okay, aka yeah. the skilled general, were considered to be unrivaled. Monstrous battery the duo battery in that. the middle school baseball world. Ah, it's a baseball anime. Okay, okay. Who is the animation? It is Mappa. Okay, oh. okay, All Mappa. Right. Let's see what you've been cooking. <clears throat> <laughs> Don't be an idiot. That did not scare you. It's like those TikTok videos where he's like, <laughs> Bro! I could believe him if he was wearing headphones, but nah. 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 I fucking hate them for that. What the hell, bro? Man, Mappa just triggered my fight or flight, man. Bro, I didn't think it was going to go that fast. What, what the f is this facial expression? <laughs> what, what, what is, what yeah, is that? That's just nothing. That is nothing. Bro, thinking. What is? What is? What is that facial expression, man? I am always Konameke. Welcome to me. What? 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 This is what an average conversation with Sydney is like sometimes. <laughs> but we, we were having this conversation <laughs> with this voice actor. Sometimes we're talking about how we deal with some fans who might not know the social cues. So he was like, all right, here's how I deal with it. Okay, um, just tell me the first thing that comes to your mind. Tell me anything. And Sydney just goes, what are the color of your nipples? <laughs> just, I was like, Sydney, what the, what the f I can't unsee his, whoa, what was that chat? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was looking at chat and I was like, did I just see some cake there? The animation actually seems pretty decent, aside right. from some uncanny shots, which weren't so noticeable at all. But it, it looks like from what they've shown that uh, the CG integration is only just getting better. I am going to give this one one episode and see if it has the possibility to do something special.
All right, moving on. That's uh. That's what the fuck is that title? The banished former hero. This lives one. As he Alan, I'm... I think that's on Crunchyroll actually. I was going through the the thing before. Toy called a failure because he was not blessed with a gift from God is actually a former hero who still has the memories and powers of his past life. Wait a minute, he's the guy I sleep reincarnation slash regression. All right, all right. Got it all. Tick all the boxes. Yo. Oh, mate, this is a tune. The music be like, whoa. God damn. Yeah. The animation be like. <laughs> Chilling. Oh my god, what a tune. What an absolute tune. This boss. Excuse me, excuse me. Can you stop going so hard? This is absolute slick. This is so cool. Please. Oh my god. Oh. <gasps> oh my god, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I know I'm gonna forget. Someone in the comments just let me know what the, the, the song name is for that. I need it. I wanna watch that again. I kind of wanna watch that again, guys. Holy shit. I, that was I, I'm not ready to move on yet. I love all the different anime stuff. That was, um, oh, what was that one? Oh, never mind, never mind. <laughs> oh, base. Oh, what a uh, God damn. King banger. What a tune. Um, yeah, I'm skipping this one. Girls band cry. The world lets us down all the time. Nothing goes as planned, man. This, 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 God this, this damn. Game, this is getting real, man. This, this, this is getting real. But we want something that we can continue to like. We believe there's a place where we belong. That's why we, we sing. sing. Yo, I'm ready for depressed bocce. Let's, <laughs> let's go. Let's. Oh dear. Oh dear. The animation already is just made me go. In chat, every time there's CG. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just like, wait, the synopsis. I'm interested. Straight away, I was just like, oh. It's CG again every time. Just like I, I was, I was in there. I thought this had a chance, and then my PP just went Rudius, man. What the? <laughs> fuck? PP went Rudius. <laughs> <laughs> And like BB went rude ears. Oh, well, he's fine now. It's okay. That opening episode, we definitely got a yeah, yeah. Those cats, those cats knew. Those cats knew. It is not bad. I think the only thing that looks a bit off about this sometimes is that during some shots, it doesn't look as natural as something on Studio Orange level. I am a sucker. Yeah, we can be stars final, 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 final season this year, aren't we? For music anime, especially if that music is like just a bunch of anime girls doing some rock music some j-rock music I'm, I'm sold i'm sold tea. i'm gonna give this one one, I one episode moving on to hananoi kun to i'm addicted to you god that sounds so stalkerish this is a story about first love between a girl who doesn't understand romantic love and a boy that may be a bit too heavy-handed when it comes to love Ugh. red flag the <laughs> <laughs> Red flags the anime. <laughs> is it Kanahana's hour? Oh. I've not heard her voice in a while. I'm addicted to you. <laughs> what is that title? I'm addicted to you, bro. This is Red Flags the anime, man. It's alright, you. Alright, you. Jesus Christ, what the fuck? Okay. I'm gonna give this one a shot. I'm gonna give this one an episode. Moving on to Henjin no Sarada Boru. Sosuke, an impoverished detective, meets Sara, a princess from another world with magical power. Oh my god! It's isekai alert! Ooh. Meanwhile, Livia, a female knight who came from the same world as Sara, found herself lost and homeless, but surprisingly enjoyed her days here. What? Oh. <laughs> New York f***ers be like, well, I can't afford a home, but you know, at least the food goes hard, man. <laughs> wow. Wow. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm liking the vibe of this one. Is that, um... 
Conan the Detective. I think she's reading Conan the Detective there, isn't she? I think she is. I spotted it. I'm good at this. Easter Man, egg. I'm liking the vibe no. of this one. <laughs> I'm really liking the... <laughs> I was going to say. The most unnecessary shots, Gigguk. I'm really taking the vibe. The vibe of this one. <laughs> 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 She was, singing, she was singing Detective Conan. If this is uh, so, she was reading the manga as well. So there we go. Actually, like funny. I will give this one three episodes. If this one just seems like your cute, chaotic, cute anime girl kind of show, uh, I'm gonna give this one one episode. Moving on to Hibike Euphonium third season. <laughs> I've never heard of this, and it's on its third season. Okay. <sighs> you think the previous show was cute? Had cute anime girls in it? No, no. You can Gen Alphas. You don't know what peak Moe is <laughs> until you've watched a Kyoto animation show. All right. <laughs> Banger tunes from like some of the. I mean that that one. Please guys, please someone post in the comments what that one that you, you even played twice was. But blah. <laughs> so, someone in chat go Violet Evergarden vibes, bro. <laughs> what? Does he know? Does he know? I might not be watching this right away because this is something that I would like to rewatch because it has been a very, very, very long time oh, since right, okay, I so he's, have he's, uh, okay, seen Hibiki Euphonium. Okay. When did the first one come out? The first one came out like so fucking long ago 2015 oh my god, oh my god. there's an entire That's generation like of anime fans that are like yo nearly. mappa mappa the goat man mappa the goat Jujutsu, they made Jujutsu kaisen and you it's like the goats are like you and demon slayer <laughs> moving on to how do i pronounce this high speed, high speed it's Rin once had a dream of becoming a ballet dancer. I wasn't close. I was close. But had to give up the dream due to an I was close. Injury. Afterwards, she became a neat. That's what she said. God damn it. Sorry about that. And a gamer who lived in her grandma's house. But one day, she is suddenly thrown into the world of racing. The anime takes place in the near future, where the latest technology has made it so vehicles can travel at 500 kilometers an hour. That's the near future. 310 miles per hour in a car safely and securely in a race uh, shut up shut, I can... how big's the track to be able to do that you're going that friggin fast they gotta be some big fucking turns i can already feel, I can already <laughs> feel your looks man i just Cha, I didn't need to turn around to know what you guys were saying man i can i can i can feel what you're saying already all right i just don't <sighs> Oh yeah! Video game music vibes. Is this a gacha game? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, it might be. <laughs> oh dear god. It's a gacha game. It's, it's, it's gonna be. Must be. <laughs> wait, it's Yostar? Okay, okay, wait, wait. I totally didn't know. She got that Yostar sponsorship, man. <laughs> Where are my talking points at? She got Yostar all over, man. Oh, How God. much is she being paid? Yo, Yostar, where's my sponsorship, man? Like it's an original? Yostar are making an anime oh, original wow. show? Don't lie to me, Yostar. Don't lie to me. When is the release date? When am I getting my login bonus? You know, I like, I like, I like to give CG a chance. And the character models didn't look bad. The thing that put me off was that it didn't feel like the cars were going at 500 kilometers an hour. Like the synopsis was. That average. really doesn't. They look like they're just going normal speed. That's what I'm saying. If you were to do that, you'd need to have such massive, like bends and everything for them to just be like because if you're trying to turn normal on a, on a track like that it's just impossible yeah obviously they were going fast but no faster than any car in overtake or anything like that i'll give this one an episode just to see how fast the cars actually go all right moving on to Jisan Basan Wakagairu. The story of Jisan Basan Wakagairu follows Shozo and Ine, an elderly couple who are living a quiet life in a farming village in Aomori Prefecture. Oh, wait. We have main characters who are an old elderly couple? No more high school? Yeah, that's actually very valid. This does not happen very often. 
A new idea. Not even university age? Not even Japanese businessman? Okay. After eating a mysterious apple that they discover on the apple farm, Shozo and Ine spontaneously ah, regain their youth. Okay, okay, okay. Had me for a second. Had me for a I second. Know, yeah. But even after being re reinvigorated, they continue their life at grandparently pace. Hold up a second. So it's like, right, we're young again, but we are just going to chill. Um, <clears throat> is this regression? Uh, are, are we are we uh, are we getting regression in Aomori Prefecture as well? Anna's Katakawa. <laughs> Daddy, <you're> <laughs> well, I, I, wait, hold on a second. Did I read that right? Yeah, I... Give me grandma. <laughs> Oh, hold up. I, <laughs> I don't want to know. I thought this was meant to be a wholesome anime. Chisama? Hey! No! Sticky, dabe. I'm not going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. Oh, I'm going Man, that shit's so adorable, minus the uh, whatever saucy things was going yeah, that's on. Weird. I'm fing sold. I'm gonna give this one three episodes. Uh, I will say. Come on, come on. Gecko? Studio Gecko? You, you can be real. Is this a. Uh... What else have they made? Doesn't, doesn't scream anything to me, Studio Gecko. Is this paid advertisement for the Aomori Prefecture? I, 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 I didn't miss that part. I didn't miss that part because uh, you specifically made it take place in Aomori oh, okay. about their apples. This oh. apple that gives you magical powers to regress in age. Everything in Aomori has apples. You, you know, I hate okay. to report you to the FTC because if this is an advertisement, this needs hashtag ad on it. Oh. As a YouTuber, Don't. I would know. It's so, right. next up, we have Kaito Otome to Kamikakushi. An aspiring novelist teams up with an enigmatic colleague to solve supernatural urban mysteries. Ogara Sumireko is busted, uh, is a busty... You have to have that in there, don't you? It's like, she got boobs, she got boobs, so it makes it interesting. <laughs> Is this, is this is this a really important detail yeah, why to have in your synopsis? Is a busty bookstore clerk who wants to become a novelist after some writing success in her youth. I remember this one because I presented this at last year's AX. Oh. And uh, this was the poster. All right. <laughs> All right. All now right. I understand why that was in. so yeah. necessary to put that in your plot synopsis. Because, because God damn, is this plot important to the plot? <laughs> I came here for boobs. I didn't come out to be fucking terrified, man. <laughs> I came here for boobs, not to be terrified. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, what does that change in animation? What is that? That's so weird. All right, don't don't worry. Don't don't ask why I re rewinded that. Don't. I was just I was just checking an important scene. Did we just get debated with plot only to find out that we might actually have plot? I think I'm gonna give this one three episodes. Oh. I d that this seems like like Monogatari, but next. a bit more horror on the horror. Kaiju number eight is next. If you've not read the manga, get on it. I've read the first nine volumes of it. I cannot wait. Kind of wish Annie News was gonna do like cut content videos on it because I've read the manga. But you know, so, so interestingly enough, I will be able to watch it and then <gasps> compare. So I might do that. When I do my Patreon, I might be like, hey, that happened, in the, and that didn't happen, like that. and I'm not sure about that. And Horror side of things, it felt like the writer was just like, yeah, let's just give one of the main girls, like, massive bowling ball yeah. bodongas, yeah. but uh, let's just actually write something. Why is, and then you might ask, why do you need to do that? And then the writer is probably like, 
Let's Why not? Next up, we have... Yes, this is going to be so good. This is going to be so good. Watch it. Everybody needs to watch this. Kaiju number eight. <laughs> Yo, Kaiju's looking sick, actually. Yo, she is so annoying at first, but she, she grows on you. Yo! Cinderay detected! Cinderay detected! Let's go! <laughs> Yes. Oh, shit. That That's last scene looked good. like it went hard, man. One thing that stood out to me immediately was they made a Shonen Jump protagonist and he's in his goddamn 30s, man. My fellow 30-year-olds, yeah. we will reclaim the Shonen genre. The even story, though Shonen it? It doesn't mean... Like he's, it feels like he missed out on the opportunity when he was younger, but then it's like, now you can go for it, man. You can do it. You can do it. In people our age, it, it doesn't, doesn't matter. matter. Someone please Oh yeah, Youngblood's doing like the opening and then like all the outro and someone else that's like a West, uh, Western on it, um, artist is doing like Did I just well. see Youngblood? Yeah, yeah, and then I can't remember who the outro Youngblood is. Youngblood and One Republic? What yeah, there you go, One Republic. Wait, is Harry on Twitter? Is this Elon Musk funded? Where does it say it's airing on Twitter? I don't believe- Oh! Oh! That's weird. Elon trying to buy our anime now. Best still be on Crunchyroll though. What the fuck? Now, are you are you serious about this? <laughs> Twitter and Crunchyroll. What oh, is the Crunchy world World coming to? That's mad. So it's actually on Twitter. That's so bizarre. So this like is it, production IG. So Kaiju number eight. I've read the first twenty or so chapters of it, and is that I all? Is that all? I was a big fan. I was a massive fan. Number one, because the main character is actually someone, an age that I can relate to. But even even beyond that, I've, one thing I have a soft spot is when someone has a hidden identity that they have to hide from everyone else. Even aside from that, it looks like production IG are going fucking hard yeah, with this production. Um, the animation looks great. Uh, the music and direction seems like they have Yo. got... This I can't wait for this. This is going to be so good. Metal kind of tone to it. Regardless to say, I am definitely going to be watching Kaiju number eight. Yes. Uh, this is looking like it's going to be one of the bigger shows of the season. Moving on to Kamiwa Game ni Yuteru. God's Game Reply. Don't you just mean life? The gods grew bored and decided to create challenging oh. battles of wit to spice oh, okay. things up. No, no, okay, they're messing with us, okay. Their opponent, <laughs> humanity. No game, no life meets record of Ragnaroks. All right. Mm. What? Yeah. The aesthetic for this looks almost like no game, no life, but no game, no life had a way more unique look to it. We went from the kaiju trailer to- I'm still not watching No Game No Life movie, which is a prequel as well. I'm like, oh. But I want the sequel. Give me more. This. <laughs> I would normally skip this one, but I ha I have like a soft spot for trashy stories with like No Game No Life esque mm. kind of like vibe. It's probably not going to be that good, but I'll give this one an episode just, just to, to see, see how the games yeah. are. What is this one? Studio Piero? Karasu wa Aruji wo Erabanai. In the world of flying crow humans, <laughs> just yeah that's that's a thing trouble is brewing yukia is the lax luster second son of a regional boss in the north house territory so it comes to a shock when this boy is the one chosen to attend the imperial prince in court what awaits yukia and his new master is intrigue murder a mysterious drug and invasion from an unexpected enemy Chat, don't think I missed the guy who said birds turn me on, so I'll give this one three episodes. That's so weird. Bro. Bro, what? You think we'd miss that, bro? What? Huh? I'll be honest, I'm not such a big fan of this kind of setting. Apothecary Diary. Although, Revenger was cool. I liked Revenger. This was kind of like the exception to that rule because it was just such a good show. I'm going to give this one a chance because the animation looked decent. Mm. I'm going to give this one one episode, but it's going to have to do a lot 
One episode because of the birds. <laughs> Next up, we have Kenka Dokugaku. Scrawly high school student, Hobin Yu, is probably the last guy you'd expect to star in a you in a new YouTube channel. Not a YouTube channel, but a new YouTube channel. Channel? New tube, excuse me, that revolves around fighting. Ah, okay. This is uh World Star. Alright, alright. But after following some advice from a mysterious new tube channel. Hobin is soon knocking out guys stronger than him and raking in more Yo. money than he could ever have dreamed of. Yo, that's that shit is banned off YouTube, man. If you the if the fight's that. too violent, that is, I get that shit gets banned off YouTube. What? Yo, Fight Club, bro, let's go. Click on a school the anime. Is this a guy that learns how to fight off that self-defense guy on YouTube? <laughs> bro, seen one TikTok and he's like, wait a minute. Okay, I have everything. All right, you have a gun? All right, I just got to do this. I am now a boxing expert. This is pretty much the manhwa experience. If you use too many brain cells, you might hamper your enjoyment. But if you don't, it's going to be fun. I'm going to give this one an episode. Moving on to Kimetsu. Oh, of course. Demon Slayer's back as well. Oh, my God. Whoa! Oh, no, Yaiba, season three. We have. Uh, is it season three? No, season four. No. Because we had season one. Then we had the Mugen train arc. Season two. Oh, it is season four. Oh, he's right. <laughs> Training arc? You know what? I like, I like Demon Slayer, man. I do like it. It's not something that I go out of my way for. But I do enjoy watching it weekly when it comes out, you know? So so then what I'm going to have? I'm going to have Mashuka Tensei. Uh, that time I was reincarnated as a slime. My Hero Academia, if the recaps don't push me off. Uh, Kaiju number eight. Uh, and Wow, cool. Training arc. All right, I'll say. Can I say anyone? That's a bit too much. Like, 6-6 six, six is like, ah, ah. Because then I tend to catch up with others. Like, I'm trying to watch Metallic Rouge. I'm on episode five. And I was like, hmm. Because I remember really enjoying the first episode of Metallic Rouge. I was like, I'll binge the rest. And I'm trying to binge the rest. And I'm finding it hard to binge the rest. I'm stuck on episode five and I don't want to watch it. Because it's like, ugh. But... Take it. I'll, ta I'll take a training arc. Where's, yes. where's, where's the boy? Where's our main boy? There hey. he is. All I can say is, guys, of course I'm going to be watching it. Yeah. It's, it's Demon Slayer oh, again. Are, are we... Well, that's gonna be six. Ah, it's too much. My brain's gonna explode. You're looking at the best fantasy anime of 2024 <laughs> right yeah. here. Obviously, Free Run didn't qualify for last year, and uh, nor did Delicious and Dungeon. But can someone finally take Demon Slayer's throne as the best fantasy anime we of all time see. at this point? I can't even think of another fantasy anime that comes close. Are we even Come on, get to Konosuba! Get to Konosuba! Even halfway? <laughs> Bro. Let's oh, wow. continue with Konosuba yes. Season 3. I now, am I so excited! I don't need to give the synopsis of <gasps> Konosuba. Alright, chat, who, who's your girl? Who Who is your chosen one? Shadow. Shadow. <laughs> <laughs> Mega Man, I Mega said Man. shadow, I made darkness. What the fuck? Mega Man, darkness, <laughs> darkness, darkness. Aqua Why not getting some blood. Shadow, oh my god. Oh, look. Because um, oh, Evidence and Shadow vibes, Isekai, oh, they're all merging into one thing. My brain can't comprehend. Oh, Aqua is so useless. Guys, what? Come on, guys. You can share a drink with her. <laughs> Aqua is the only unacceptable answer. <laughs> brilliant brilliant that's that's my girl that's 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 my girl <laughs> that's that's my girl right there my girl my on, girl being as useful as always of course i'm going to be watching yes. this and i am very very excited all right moving on i remember this one was a kid's show uh i don't even know if this has a pv so we are going to skip this one to go to the continuation of black butler oh now, isn't that interesting? Yeah. Never seen Black Butler myself, but like, that's made me kind of go, oh, wow. Oh, 
The return of OG Sea Dog VA is coming back, man. I'm ready for my Sebastian prank calls. Sorry, I like my own comment because no one else. <laughs> Yes, my lord. <laughs> you don't even need any screen time in the PV. That's cool. that's enough. The ninety three percent live again. Be real with me. Is is it is this is this gonna be worth it? Is Black Butler still hitting hard in twenty twenty four? You weren't part of the seven percent. No, no. I'm going to be watching this if enough people will go out of the way to be like, yo, this is going so hard right now. This is going super super hard. Tumblr ain't a thing anymore, guys. Come on, come on. We got TikTok. <laughs> TikTok is when the, where we've all migrated over. Yeah, I'll, I'll put this in the maybe. Okay, okay, okay. Is this uh, is this an isekai? Yeah, this this is an isekai. Chilling in another world with my level two super cheap powers. Oh my god. This is the most original isekai premise <laughs> I've seen so far. He's not starting at level one? No way. Yeah, this is a skip. This is such a skip. Hold on. Come on, give me a skip. Guys, hold on, hold on. Just, just, just fight it. Fight it! Content warning. The following video contains oh, is this in the actual video? sensitive scenes and may be inappropriate for some viewers. Children as well as youth audiences, please exercise caution before watching. Woo! We covered, we covered boys. Oh, okay. Muse Asia content warning uh, are coming to save the day once again. We've <laughs> saved it guys. We have saved the children. <laughs> Oh, well, that's a lot of girls. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm interested. Of right. <laughs> course. All right, tell me more. All right, time to sit up. Uh, all right. <laughs> all right, I'm sitting back down now. <laughs> oh, goddamn. Wow. <laughs> Jeez, how many girls do we this want here, man? What is this? This must be a based on a game or something. Jesus freaking Christ. I've seen enough. I am satisfied. Well, guys, usually I would like to give every isekai a chance, but this is a competitive is season. Regular and you know what? I think, I'm, I think I'm going to be more picky with my isekai going? from now on. I have evolved into a regression brain rock kind of guy. So you know what? I think I'm going to skip this. I know, I've changed. I've changed. Traitor. <laughs> All right. Moving. It is. Third Are you season. Why am I seeing Mahoka in 2024? <laughs> the original Alabama anime? Hey. Is this the 10th anniversary? Wow. <laughs> Yo, only celebrating peak fiction. Am I right, guys? So not this time. <laughs> Thank you very much, commenter. He just went, he's Gojo, but incestuous. <laughs> You're so right. <laughs> Lisa? <laughs> Lisa in my whole God. <laughs> okay, we're so back. Because I I watched the first season of a regular Magic High School because I wanted to watch the parody that... Um... Oh, who was it? Was it Das Tales or was it... Um... Uh... Disaster... Oh, I can't remember, but I watched it so that I could protect. And I was just like, this is so dumb. Boys. I mean. I mean, sometimes you have a uh, soft spot for, like, you know. No, yeah, don't say I'm it. not beating any of those allegations anytime soon. <laughs> the Archdemon's Dilemma How to Love Your Elf Bride. 2024 really is the year of the elf, yeah. isn't it? Zagan might be the most feared evil, evil oh. sorcerer, but when it comes to social interaction, he's the most inept. <laughs> All those days studying the dark arts won't help him when he falls in love at first sight with Nephilia, the beautiful elven slave. Oh, God. <laughs> Hitting me with those classic plot points, baby. Oh. Slavery bad. And spends his entire fortune to purchase her. Whoa. Oh. The most romantic thing I've heard all day. Yeah. Bro. <laughs> Bro, who just said IRL wailing, man? Bro's living the gacha dream. 
買い取ったなど誰がどう聞いても変態だ。Oh. Oh. <laughs> Our mantic power, however, how nice of him to keep the collar on. Engagement necklace. Yeah, that's what I'm going to call it. Honey, do you want to get an engagement necklace? Jesus Christ. Ring for you. I got a nice little necklace for you, though. It's a promise ring. It's a promise that you will never leave me because you cannot. Episode. Okay, guys. Episode, is Slavery is bad. <laughs> I said that. But that looks pretty wholesome. I'm going to give this an episode. Yeah. All right. Now we're talking. <laughs> hey, that opening episode. Coming back. I quite liked it. I quite liked it. It was still more of the slice of life feel. But I don't think that's going to last long. I feel like they're giving us false hope. Making us feel like it's gonna be nice and then something's gonna happen and just punch us right in the dick. Now we are talking Mishoku Tensei Season 2, Part 2. Yes. Oh. oh, look at that happy life. Rudy? Yeah. I, I need to sit up for this. The first episode was so good. Hi. Wait, sister? Sister is here? We got Oh, I've not watched the trailer. Oh my god, so many characters returning. Oh my god, this is gonna be so crazy. Boy Motos? Oh my god! Ah! Wait, wait, is he coming back? Oh, legend! Yo, Legend. the gang is coming back! Things seem to be going too well, man. Some yeah, that's what I'm saying. They are. Some bad shit's gonna go down. It has to. Has to. Something seems wrong. This this is this Mishoku Tensei. I should never get too comfortable, yeah. right? Best dad is coming back. We get to see more. We get to see the sisters as well. Maybe we'll find his mum. Who knows? Who knows what we're gonna Oh up no, season. that's gonna be the thing, isn't it? They're gonna find the mum, and something bad's gonna have happened there. Oh no, no! Why did you have to say that? No! I am not gonna look at chat right now because I don't want to be spoiled on anything, just in case. But I am very, very fucking excited. Excited for more Mishoku Tensei. Moving on. One room Hiatari Futsu Tenshitsuki. Shintaro Tokumitsu is a high schooler living all alone, but things take an unexpected turn when a girl named Toa shows up on his balcony. Not only is she incredibly pure and sweet, but there's something different about her. Something divine. <laughs> What was that? What was oh okay? <laughs> I think I did the same thing he said. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> no. Yo, what was that the look, frame? Like, that looked like something else. There. King of that shot, man. <laughs> <laughs> I just can't get over the short. <laughs> That's all I was thinking. Me when a new hype anime gets announced, man. <laughs> this seems like a Moe Blob show just with actual oh romance in it. God. I am probably going to give this one one episode. Moving on to Oi. Oi. Tombo. Oi, Tombo. You want to play some fucking golf, golf, yeah? The story begins with Igarashi, who was disqualified as a pro golfer after a certain incident and thus moved moves to the Kagoshima prefecture's Tokura Islands to step out of the limelight. On these islands, known as Japan's last unexplored wilderness, he encounters a naive girl named Tombo. As it turns out, these supposedly unexplored islands have homemade golf courses where what the f- 
<laughs> where Tombo so plays random. every single day. She demonstrates genius level prowess, playing every kind of shot with just one golf club, a three iron. Jesus Christ. A three iron is like the hardest golf club to use as well. Sounds like Happy Gilmore, but like... <laughs> <laughs> Everything. Uh, uh, okay, it's one of those. It's uh, hey, hey, Japan. It's pretty rewarding raising kids. Japan, Japan. If it has like actual drama in it and not just hey, look at how wholesome it is to raise this daughter, except with golf, I probably would be less interested. But if there was some actual drama in there, I might be more interested. I'll give this one one episode. Moving on to Spice and wow. Wolf. When, when, when did the original Spice and Wolf come out? I was going to say, is this a sequel or is it a remake? Because I've not seen the original before. So this is intriguing. If it's a, oh. you know, if it's a remake, Mike. 2008? God damn. 15 years? Jesus. So if you're a new anime fan, even if you're just like relatively new, like in the past decade anime fan, you might not know about the saga we've gone through with Spice and Wolf. For the longest time, Spice and Wolf was that meme show I've that we to check it waited out. and waited and waited for another season. This was our No Game No Life. Also, Kevin Penkin is doing the soundtrack for this. Cool, very and cool. I am very, very fucking excited because in private, he's told me just how hard he has worked on this soundtrack he has put his blood sweat and tears into this soundtrack wow that already just hits that sounds boss oh kevin 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 wow there's so much emotion boy boy you gotta stop with these vibes and the feels man so is it is it a sequel or is it a remake? So long. Oh, oh. 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 Oh, the ear animation, man. Oh, we don't need we don't need we don't need no head hats. Studio Passion are uh, animating this and uh, you might know their work from such classics as interspecies reviewers uh -huh. they, they they look like they're using their skills and their talent to good use man they're turning wholesome <laughs> hey man hey man if, if if you know spice and wolf you know <laughs> you know holo there is a lot of scenes with holo which uh yeah i like it this is a jiggy tune. Very jiggy with the clappies. Wait, Clarice as well? What, what, what is this year? I feel like I'm 23 again, man. It's going to be as hard of a sell as it originally was because this got famous because the way people described this was, hey, it's an anime about economics. But while you are learning economics, you have a cute wolf girl who helps you through everything that makes it sound better yes mm, i see mm. <laughs> moving on to re monster, re -monster. tomokui re kanata is reincarnated as a lowly goblin oh my god oh do you know oh, what no. right some people have posted things on facebook saying this is actually all right mm. thanks to his ability that allows him to grow stronger the more he feeds his feeble status quickly changes and rises up to become the goblin leader goblin. <laughs> Oof. We got some goblin ladies. They ain't, they ain't show that in Goblin Slayer. What? Maybe we've been too harsh to Goblin. <laughs> Do you think? <laughs> oh, no. This entire time. Maybe, maybe Goblins are just misunderstood. No, no, no. Not within the world of Goblin Slayer. I'm sorry. No, 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 no. Maybe in this kind of universe but down yeah honestly this looked like a lot of fun um i'm gonna give this an episode okay. all right moving on rinkai. to rinkai the story centers on the sport of women cycling skip 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 <laughs> sorry i'm joking no i'm joking i'm messaging i'm not watching this <laughs> sorry i just remember that clip yeah, shut the fuck up you're making me laugh <laughs> just reading that line reminded me of joey going woman basketball and then me and connor just laughing out of context woman basketball 
Oh, good. Oh, good. Jeez. Just a little bit of misogyny. Oh, no. CGI out. No, thank you. E. Oh! <laughs> they think we wouldn't notice. They, th they think we wouldn't notice. Cool shot, bro. Uh, the cycling that didn't look like fantastic animation. No. I am going to have to skip this one. Because of that and nothing else. It's not because it's women cycling, okay? <laughs> just, just, I, 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 moving on yeah. to Sasayaku Yoni Koi Utao. After performing a song at her school's opening ceremony, musician Yori Asanagi receives an apparent love confession from freshman Himari Kino. But just as Yori decides she wants to return Himari's feelings, Himari reveals that she did not love her, but admires her. Okay. We 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 go we go are we going there? Oh. If we going full Yuri? Oh, this looks cute, man. Oh shit! It's given with girls. That's basically it. Bro, this is what bocce fans see when they watch bocce, man. That was um. <laughs> I'm sold enough to give it a chance. I'm gonna give this one an episode. <laughs> Moving on to Seiyu Radio Ooh. no Urao Motte. Yuhi Yugure and Yasumi Utatani, high school classmates and co-hosts of a weekly radio program, paint a picture-perfect friendship for their listeners. Yet, in reality, their off-air dynamic is a whirlwind of chaos and insult. Oh, I love that. I absolutely love that. Ah. Ah, true friendship. True friendship. They navigate the turbulent waters of friendship and rivalry in the cutthroat realm of showbiz. Have we had a voice acting anime before? No. It's called Trash oh. Taste. Shut the f*** up. <laughs> you girls do Trash Taste. These girls would get way more viewers than us. Oh my god. Is Go Go Loser Ranger this month as well? I've just seen that. As the next one. Well, wait, well, wait, wait, wait. If it's so, ah, I'm too hyped. My brain's going to explode. Oh, please, come on, come on. You had, you had something interesting. You had something interesting. Please do not turn this into an, an, like a, a standard idol show. <laughs> Damn it! I got tricked once again. Dude. How long will they keep getting away with this? The it is! That must be it! Ah. Actually, even for the idol concert, how many episodes? I was gonna give this three, and then they, uh, hmm. <laughs> and then it went a direction. I'll give this one episode. I I'll, I'll give this one episode. Next up! Oh my god! This season's so sick! Oh god! We have Sentai yeah. Yo Star again! Again? Yo, Star, what is this based on? It's based on a manga. Yeah, it is. This looks so good. I love this. I love the concept of the good guys won, but it was televised every week. And their popularity is going to go down if they can't keep doing that. So they have all the bad guys put away. And it's like, right, you choose your monster of the week. But then one of them's like, no, we can't just keep doing this. And then he tries to become the next ranger. In the, and then he learns all the truths and everything, the behind the scenes. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, ah. Not your games. Um, I see girls, but I also see men. This can't be a gacha game. Super Sentai accepts we are following the villains. Yes. yes. This looks so good. This is the quintessential quintuplets author. Whoa. What? This looks so good. Actually, this is kind of popping off. This is great. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> Wait, this got What's style, going? man. It's the boys, but Super Sentai. Oh. Yeah, yeah, all right, yeah. Take that. All right, that's all you need to say. Oh, there's too much. I reckon that's not on Crunchyroll. I'm gonna have to find a way to watch that. I need to check that out. Oh. This one's a three episode at least. I took a nap and gone is still streaming. All right, see, <laughs> sums it up. Shinka Lion changed the world. Whoa, they look so cool. What is this? Is this the mecha with the Shinkansen? Yo. Is this part of the Gridman series? It's not. Oh. 
<laughs> what is going on? Trash Taste Figure Special. Yeah, it was on the Trash Taste Figure Special, right? It's an Ava collab with Sincarion. That That's is the not Ava. the Ava. That's the Ava. That's a train. It's a train. That's a literal this train. It's a literal down. transform. It literally says it on the fucking box. Yeah, I'm, pro I'm probably going to skip that one. All right, here's another train anime. Train, Shizuru and, and three four. other girls board an Grid abandoned train. Back, and they set out to the outside world where survival is not certain. Good. Susume. Susume. I like that. How oh, it just went to the right ear, and then the beat kicked in, and then wow. Oh shit! This looks good, man. This looks good, actually. Wait, uh, I'm I'm already gonna say this right now. I am going to give this one three episodes. The big question is: Is the trailer showing us everything? <laughs> We have some cute girls exploring some post-apocalyptic world. Yeah. And it's an anime original, so obviously they have they, they have a tight control over the... Tra Everything that they can show. Right? Trailer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is this going to be something where it we watch the first few... It's going to be something really wholesome, and then you watch the first episode, and it is, and the second episode is like, They're all dying! What at a time! The, the train is actually feeding off of... There's no coal, so they have to throw one into the into the burner to keep it going because if the train stops completely everyone dies episodes whoa, and then what it a concept. ain't as cute as it originally yeah, imagine that whoa if the train stops they all die but it has to feed off of them so they have to decide who goes into the burner next to keep the train going but eventually they're all gonna die anyway but then they just keep it oh ah. it out to be. or whoa. is it going to be Something like a girl's last tour, which is also a vibe. Oh, I like my idea. <laughs> Something's going on, man. This, this, this is no girl's last tour. This is no girl or girl's last tour. <laughs> Something, something's going on, man. Uh, you're, you're not gonna fool me with this other. opening, man. You're not, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, not again. I've seen Madoka. I've seen... That's what I'm saying. Like, I, I know what happens with that. It's like, well... In school life, oh, no. <laughs> what was he doing there? <laughs> oh, okay. Pulled. <laughs> the, those that were shot some, was close to the first time. Really good trailers that's how you do a trailer the direction seems really really good as well who's the director girls in panzer oh no good way he directed this <laughs> this is I know this one <laughs> this is uh, this was fucking peak but for the wrong reasons man oh he did shiro bako and prison school bro what is this guy's cv and he did another <laughs> tadaima or kairi ah uh... I can already, this is, this is gonna be a feel-good anime man. Masaki Fujiyoshi is a stay-at-home spouse and parent. He has fought long and hard with the feelings of being a burden to his loving husband. Hiromu, due to his status as an Omega. <laughs> okay. What? What, 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 what does that mean? <laughs> Oh, 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 Japan, Japan, you want babies, right? You, you, you want, you want babies? What is an Omega? What's I'm, 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 I'm gonna, I'm gonna search this up now. Omega meaning. I feel like I'm missing context for this. Omega is the lowest ranking species in the Omegaverse Alphaverse universe. Unlike its alpha counterpart, Omegas are generally sh kind, shy, sweet, smart, and hardworking. Omegas tend to have a strong, sweet scent. They don't mate with other Omegas, just betas and alphas. They go through heat, which are cycles of arousal when the body is ready for mating. Uh, what? 
This has confused me even more. What's the Omegaverse? A dark side of fan fiction. I feel like this is going to dive into some sort of weird, like, oh, okay. Oh, An AU where alpha people and beta people and, and omega people, etc. In this AU, omegas go through time of the year slash month, depending on what you read, where they are in heat. Like animals, they need to be knotted where an alpha has sex with them and comes inside them to release from pain. Depending on what you read, the omega may require this more than once or just once. <laughs> what the f*** am I reading? <laughs> Alphas cannot resist the smell of an omega in heat and they will try to have sex with them. Betas are very common. Alphas are somewhat rare and omegas are rare, making them valuable. In some stories, omegas are treated like gods because the best sex is with an omega. In others, they are treated like animals and slay- What am I reading? What is this? is so weird. What is this? What is this? What is this? What? What is going on? This genre of smart fan fiction was started in the supernatural fandom and spread to the anime fandoms like wildfire. Omega verse are most prevalent in anime fandoms, particularly fairy tale. Blue Exorcist and other mostly fantasy animes. Guys, I I, I, I don't want to be here. Oh, bro, bro. Oh, it's got something very, very bizarre here. I've clowned on Fairy Tale. Their Fairy Tale doesn't deserve this, man. Guys, look, look, look. It's 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 wholesome, guys. It's it's <laughs> guys. It's really, it's really wholesome. God. I can't stop thinking who's the Omega, who's the Alpha, and who's the Beta now. <laughs> this is, this is really crazy. Wait, was that, was that the bite mark? What's on the back of his neck? The Omega has a mark behind the neck? No. No. Don't tell me this is canon shit, man. How the fuck I can't No. I not <laughs> No. no! No! I thought the synopsis was just trolling, man. What the f? Does, does anyone know how to unlearn information? I guess. <laughs> eject! 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 Ah! Nation? You know what? Maybe I'll give this an episode and <laughs> sign up to therapy at the same time so I can uh, learn how to look at things wholesomely again. All right, as a reincarnated aristocrat, I'll use my appraisal skills to rise in the world. Ah, ah, thank God. Jesus, something I, can I recognize. can't believe something like that made me just go, our protagonist, Ars Luve, was reincarnated in another world as the young son of a minor noble who owns a small domain. Ars was not particularly strong or intelligent, but he was born with the appraisal skill that's able to see others' abilities and statuses. He uses his skill to find the best hidden talents in the world to make their small, weak domain into the best. Is he expanding his domain? Are, are we, uh, is that what we're gonna call it now? Oh, anime that ain't Roxy. All right, all right. I'll give this one an episode. Ah, moving on to is this another isekai. Two in a row. I was reincarnated as the seventh prince, so I can take my time perfecting my magical ability. <laughs> the fuck? What the fuck is uh that next thumbnail? Okay. Did baby just cook? Wow, unnecessarily heavy music. What the f is this? Yo, is this f***ing Venti's origin story? Wouldn't gliding be faster? All right, all right, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of sold. Looks like one of those shows that knows exactly what it wants yeah. to be and just doubles down on just having fun. The trailers have convinced me- That doesn't look too bad. <gasps> the time is really cut into the slime, let's go! To give let's this go! one three ah! Open episode episodes, of Boss, Diablo's Which takes amazing. us to the third season of That Time I Got Reincarnated as a Slime. Yes. 
mid? <laughs> this is mid? No. Shut up. Come on. You, you haven't watched Isekai if you think slime is mid. Yeah. It's good mid. Oh, this fight's coming. This fight is coming. God, fucking fight. Fight. God, remember who fight. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to watch this. I've already read the manga of it. Uh, didn't go as hard as the previous arc, but it was still, still, it was still decent. All right, next up we have the Fable. When you're an infamous prodigy hitman known only as the Fable, many things come easy. Being a normal person, however, isn't one of them. In fact, being told that he can't kill anyone for a while may be the hardest job the Fable's ever taken. All right, I've heard good things about this manga. I've heard good things about the comedy. <laughs> Is this the same studio that adapted Under Ninja? Yes, it is. Okay. It worries me a bit. Yeah, oh god. Watching Under Ninja, I was like, I think I'd rather read the manga for this. Yeah. Bro, stop talking vine booming me like that, man. <laughs> It doesn't look like this is going to be a great adaptation. So what's probably going to end up happening is I'm going to give this an episode or two and I'm going to be like, all right, actually, I'm just going to go read the manga. All right, next we have New Gate. The New Gate. Sorry, not New Gate. The New Gate, an online game transformed into a life and death struggle for its players. Thanks to the valiant efforts of Shin, the most powerful of them all. An end to the game and freedom for everyone seems to be within reach. But just moments after Shin defeats the game's final boss, he finds himself bathed in an unknown light and transports 500 years into the future of the in-game world. Oh. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Going back to well online. Wow. <laughs> Mind melding with a fox. <laughs> just gonna see the response. One guy was just like instant one billion percent skip, and then the next comment was literally inject this right into my veins, please. <laughs> there are two types of anime watchers. Didn't really look like it stood out a lot. I'll give it an episode. <laughs> I think I'm going to be more picky with my isekai from now on. <laughs> Curiosity killed the cats. Uh, which is exactly what we're going to do in the next one. Because we have Tonari no Yokai-san. Wait, this looks good. Backgrounds are beautiful. What? Okay, this is odd. This is, this is not just okay. <laughs> I feel like I feel like I'm gonna get emotional watching oh, this show. Yeah. Man. I, I feel uh, like I feel like I'm gonna get very emotional watching this show. Yeah, I'm giving that one three episodes. Hmm. That yeah. went straight we'll to my heart. Yeah. It looked the backgrounds looked beautiful. The music was moving. Um, vibes. Yeah, unnamed memory. Climbing a deadly tower, Oscar seeks the power of its master. He hopes her incredible magic can break a curse that will kill any woman he takes for a wife. Oh. Though he has oh, a mate. better idea since she's surely strong enough to survive his curse. She should just marry him instead. <laughs> Alright, I'm, I'm liking the chemistry between the main duo. That's 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 selling me. That's selling me. Mm. Whoa. Huh. 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 What is what, what is going what is what is going on? Oh what? She is she getting a bit saucy now? Alright, alright. I don't think episode one would be enough to give me a I that, that needs to be a three episodes. Dear yeah. what this story is going to be about. I think I gotta give this three episodes. I I, I think just to, just to see what it's about. Moving on to Vampire uh, Dormitory. Dormitory. After losing her parents and being abandoned by her relatives, Mito is left all alone in the world. She is taken in by Ruka, a vampire. In exchange for giving Ruka her blood as her food, she ends up living with him in a boy's dormitory full of beautiful boys. Sexy, sexy vampires. With unique 
personalities. Oh my God. I can feel Malin's sweaty hands already. This looked like it crawled straight out of 2005. And you know, sometimes it's not a bad thing, but I was not interested in this type of show in 2005. And I'm not interested in this show in 2024. Mom, I swear it's not a Twilight thing. I was just watching Giga. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you for that. Uh, I am going to skip that one and move on to Wind windbreaker Breaker. from cloverworks furin high school is renowned as a super school of delinquents ah another delinquent anime okay okay right. harika sakura a first year student came from the from outside the city to fight to the top <laughs> oh okay 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 get out get out of here Go, get it, get out, get out. Female detected in my delinquent anime. Give me my man, give me my man. <laughs> I like my delinquent anime. It all really pretty the much Elzebub depends. was a thing, guys. Guys, please, it existed. Hitman Reborn, guys, yes, you am are I a boomer. boomer now? You are a boomer. You are definitely a boomer. Yeah, I mean, it all pretty much depends on the animation a lot of the times. That's kind of a big reason why I could not get into Tokyo Revengers. This looks like, uh, this looks like it could have some pretty decent animation. I trust Cloverworks. Go on, clean your room. This is starting to look as bad as mine. Yeah. All right, mom. All right, all right, mom. I think I'm going to give this one three episodes, actually. Uh, speaking of studios that know what they're doing, uh, Dogo Kobo looked like they're back with another cute girl anime. Yoru no Kurake wa Oyoge Wait, wait, wait. So we got, uh, I can't be bothered to read their names. We got an illustrator, a former idol, a VTuber, and a composer. Four young. Sounds like the weirdest setup for the most modern joke ever told. <laughs> women who are sighted outside the world join together and form an anonymous artist group called Gile or G Jelly one, one, one. guys I think I think I'm smelling something am I smelling a possible idol anime am I am I getting tricked again they, they said they made an artist group animation looks good wait wait hold up hold up hold up we are cooking right now this actually looks decent this what? Okay, okay, I'm sitting, I'm sitting. This gives off. Uh, what's that Cloverworks original anime that they fucked up the ending of? Oh yeah, Wonder Egg Priority. God damn, what happened on that? <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> This just looks like a damn good show. And it's an anime original as well, oh, bro. Damn. Say no more. Who is working on this, man? What else have you worked on? Mishoku Tensei episode oh. director, Hogaku no Breath. Um, okay, seems to... Jujutsu oh. Kaisen, holy shit. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. oh my god, no. <laughs> Yo, let's go! He's back to reclaim his throne! <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's the writer for Tomazaki kun? Ach okay, 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 okay. I, 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 I do enjoy Tomazaki a lot. I do enjoy Tomazaki a lot. I'm gonna take a gamble, guys. I, I'm gonna take a gamble. I have a feeling this is going to be a uh, one to watch. Not a, not a three episode. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this as a watch. Definitely won't regret it at all. Yeah. All right, we have two shows left. Yozakura Sanchi no Daisakutsen. Taiyo Sano is a super shy high school student, and the only person he can talk to is his childhood friend, Mutsumi Yozakura. It turns out that Mutsumi is the daughter of the ultimate spy family. <laughs> Going in hard, you get. <laughs> wow, this is so stupid. <laughs> Mom, we got Zoldix at home. <laughs> All right. Oh my God, this is so this is so over the top. This is so over the top. This looks unhinged as. Man. 
I like that you had this old axe from Wandanda, like if it was a comedy. <laughs> All right, well, I did not know that that was a Shonen Jump show. I think I'll give this one one episode, at least, just to see how insane it goes. Moving on to the last show of the season, we have Eurocamp Season 3. Hey, honey. Sorry, I've just ignored you. Thank yeah. you. Oh. That's my armpit. It's what the f <laughs> This is so strange. Oh. Oh. Anime food. Oh, I'm gonna get a bag of crisps as soon as I've finished recording this. <laughs> so. Every time I go to the country, bro, every time I go to the Japanese countryside, there is a million fucking Yuru camp shit all over. I know I've reached the countryside when I go to an omiyagi shop and there's there's Yuru camp curry every, wow. every single fucking time. Uh, so yeah, of course, I'm going to be watching the new season of Yuru camp. Yuru camp was one of the two shows that sold me on Slice of Life. And now that I've been camping in Japan, that oh, just makes cool. it hits even harder. So this is a fucking stacked season. There is so much that oh, I... I think it's the first time he's done this, where he's put them into the watching. Ah, cool. So he's going to be watching. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Uh, oh, I was about to start scrolling down. <laughs> I want to watch this season. I can't even remember every... No, that's on my... I want to watch that. I want to watch that. I want to watch that. Everything that I said I wanted to watch, but I know that I am going to be watching a hell of a lot, man. God damn it. But that was my... Wholesome. <laughs> spring 2024 anime chart stream of what I will be watching. What is it that you're going to be watching this season? What? <laughs> Out of everything that we've gone through, how I thought it's shiny cool is. I love how it's going down. It just is. How many shows are on your to watch? Black Butler season ninety three percent slash list right now. Oh, slimes on my watch. Oh god. <laughs> oh, yes. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> see me making silly noises whatever it is uh tell me in the comment section below and if you like this video hey you can like and subscribe and hey i'm streaming this live on twitch if you want to catch me on twitch.tv slash giguk but anyway that's been it for me i've been giguk uh. and i'll see you all next time bye bye jesus christ that was long, long. Someone needs to let me know in the comments what that song was, but wow, yeah, so, 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 we got, I will be watching My Hero Academia as soon as the recap stop, like, it's putting me off, that time was reincarnated as a slime, Mushoku Tensei, Kaiju number eight, Konosuba, Go Go Loser Ranger, there was one more, but hey, that's six, <laughs> god damn. Um, awesome. I'm looking forward to the season. He'll obviously do anime in a nutshell when it's done. Mother's Basement will do the ones to watch and then the trash ones. So exciting, exciting times. And uh, I'll be doing Kaiju number eight reactions on the Patreon once that starts. And my Dragon Ball uh, at the moment, because I've got a lot of stuff going on, um, it's going to be one video a week on the Patreon page. But those videos will be covering three episodes at a time now. Uh, so. Anyway, thank you to my patrons. If you want to have your name at the end of every video and want to be able to watch patron-only reactions, such as the original Dragon Ball series, link in the description to the Patreon page. One dollar a month is all I ask. Tell us what channels. Great appreciate Thank you for that. And thank you all for watching. If you guys think of that. If you guys think of this, click like, subscribe if you haven't already. Leave comments down below. Let me know what I should watch and discuss in future videos. I'll see you guys later, guys. Thanks, down.